Paul, very warm welcome to Crystal Rivers. You must be delighted to join here at the cast. Yeah, no, delighted to, uh, to get down and get done early and obviously um, link up with Joey again. It was uh, one of the big attractions to coming down and can't wait to get going. Working with Joey, what kind of characteristics of him do you like working under? Um, you know, he's, he's just driven for success, so um, he, he won't settle for, for that the last and obviously we've got big plans for this season about getting, getting out of the league and getting straight back up, so we're looking forward to it and uh, hopefully I can, I can help out. Talk to us about your experience, obviously a lot of appearances, also a lot of promotions on your CV. Yeah, um, be nice to add another one, so obviously I got a little taste for League 2 last season with, uh, with Salford and it's going to be a tough division, but one that um, you know, we should be fully capable of getting out of the first half of playing basketball. In a weird twist of fate, you made your EFL debut against Rovers, we'll see what can you recollect from that day. Yeah, <laughs> you just reminded me. Uh, it, it, was, it was strange how things work out, obviously. Joined join with Sir Rovers now, we made my debut against him for Peterborough quite a few, few seasons ago now. Um, I, I remember Ricky Lambert scoring a, a superb hat-trick. But we, uh, we managed to beat, beat them 5 4, so yeah, interesting, interesting how things work out. But you mentioned that your experience has got that lead to Salford. What was your main kind of takeaways from that brief stint you had? It was your first spell in your career playing at that level, wasn't it? Yeah, it's, it, it, it's a tough division. Um, you know, all, all, all divisions are, but it, it, it was particularly difficult because the, obviously, with no fans and the uh, no real atmosphere in the games. It, it, it was really strange for me. I think last season was strange for everyone, so it'll be it'll be brilliant to get to get fans in and, and welcome them back and hopefully we can get off to a good start and, and fill the place out. Joey's obviously brought in a, a familiar face to you in Sam Finley. What kind of characteristics does he have on the pitch that you think you can kind of help to bring out? Yeah, Sam's a sort of all round midfielder, um, who I know well from Fleetwood, so I think I think it's a great signing for the club. Uh, Surprised Fleetwood have let him go, uh, but uh, you know it's a good, it's a great deal for us down here, and uh, one that the fans will, will look forward to seeing, I'm sure. Just lastly, what's your overriding goal for next season? I'm guessing having another promotion in your CV is the ultimate dream. Yeah, absolutely. I think everyone knows that Bristol Rovers should be playing in League Two, but it's where we find ourselves. So we've got to put in the hard work and you know try to get a team on the pitch which is going to go and try and win the title.